All right. If you have a dog, you know that walking the dog can be fun, it can be enjoyable, but it can also be dangerous. Yeah, everything from tripping and falling to breaking a finger in the leash can be serious concerns. WFMZ's Melanie Falcon has some safety tips in tonight's Health Beat. Ah, ah, ah. Sunny, sit. She's only three. <laughs> One more time. One more time, girl. But okay. Sunny is a 60-pound package of energy. And we wanted her to be a couch potato kind of a dog. <laughs> can laugh now when they're Not loving that. their perky pup, but Dan and Michelle Steinman cried when Sunny broke their fingers. Yes, both of them. It was the same finger, but a totally different injury. She pulled the leash, and it, it went this way, and my finger, I guess it snapped like a piece of chalk. I heard my finger snap. And I had such pain I have never had before. <laughs> Sometimes if the dog's not very easy to control, your first instinct is to put your fingers into that collar. That's the worst place to be because that dog now controls you. Dr. Fernandez's first and foremost suggestion, no retractable leashes. Because if some, something suddenly happens, now the dog is on this 10 foot, 20 foot leash uh, that gives it a lot more kinetic energy. Other dog walking faux paws, tethering them to a bike. Don't wear flip flops or go barefoot and don't wrap the leash around your hand or wrist. If the, if the animal, the dog suddenly bolts off in a different direction, you actually have less control because now you're basically being pulled like a rag doll. So you're supposed to hold the dog's leash like this and wrap your fingers around in case the dog gets loose. You, the dog will not hurt you and the it's better the dog than you, they say. Or no one, ideally. For Health Beat, I'm Melanie Falcon. Good girl. Be careful with the pooch. Yeah. Wouldn't have thought of it.